So we've done this before, and uh, this is uh, County Road 39 right here. Uh, what you do is you come out 200, well, come up 484 if you live in the villages. Uh, take a left on 200, go past uh, Ross Prairie, go over the uh, Withlacoochee River, I believe, um, and then uh, and you can come to right here. Now we've already done this hike. This is the uh, Johnson Pond Recreational Trailhead the Withlacoochee State Forest. Very nice hike. In fact, I might just do it today in addition to the trail that we're going to do. Let's go over and get the sign on the on the video real quick. But I thought I'd just start the video with this um, because, in, in, you know, if you'd have to go way back in my videos uh, to to see when I hiked the, the Johnson Pond Recreation Recreational Trail. Uh, very, very nice hike. I uh, thoroughly enjoyed it. But let's, uh, let's just, just get the sign on the video and then I'll get to the trail we're going to hike today. So let's get this on the video. Do not feed the alligators. <laughs> All right, so here's the uh, here's the sign. Now we're right here. We're at the Johnson Pond Trailhead, and then here's Johnson Pond. And you can see the trail as it goes on around. This is your hike. Uh, really nice hike. Uh, but I'm I'm going down the road just a little ways. I think uh, I think we're doing this Oxbow Trailhead today. And then, uh, well, see, here's 200, okay, and there's CR 39, okay, so you're coming in that way. And then at some point, we'll have to get down here and do this bear head hammock trailhead. I have no idea where that's at. Uh, I'm, I guess I'd have to look at this sign to try to figure out how to get there. It looks like it has camping. So, so you guys, uh, you peace out, have a good one, and uh, let's go get hiking. So just down from Johnson Pond, there's the Oxbow Trailhead, and this is what we're getting ready to do. Now this is, uh, well this is a fee area, I don't understand that, I didn't, there was no fee to get in here. Um, so, uh, and then the, the guy was telling me that you can take the Johnson Pond Trail and get this blue trail and get all the way over to the Bear Hammock Trail. So you can see there's quite a bit of hiking around in here. And then I have had a picnic on this picnic table before. And uh, let's just read the sign. It says the Oxbow Bend Recreation Area is a joint venture between the Division of Forestry, Two Mile Prairie Track, and Boy Scout Troop 415, sponsored by the Crystal River United Methodist Church. This is an ongoing partnership to open this pristine area on the Withlacoochee Wick River for the enjoyment of the public. We wish your continued support in our efforts to open state lands for your use, and I'll let you read the rest of that. And, uh, but let's get hiking. Uh, you can see there are some people here. So this is a fairly popular uh, hike. I uh, don't want to get the license plates on the video, but you got, uh, well, I'm including my car, four cars here. But let's, um, let's get on the hike. Uh, I got a couple people in front of me, but you can see right here at the beginning, it looks really quite beautiful. Um, so this is, uh, should be a fairly, uh, short and uh, beautiful hike i have a feeling and the good news is i don't have any spiders to worry about because people have just hiked it out in front of me uh you know me and spiders <laughs> and don't feed the gators man don't feed the gators well as we hike along nice touch we got a trash can here and uh look at looky over here looks uh that's a a swamp so the trail well, you can go right or go left. Imagine I might be hiking around back here for a while. But uh, we just came down that. You can see that's quite beautiful with the uh, the palm uh, or saw palmettos or whatever. I think that's what they are. And uh, and so we're kind of hiking next to a swamp here. Um, really, uh, well, of course, well maintained. And, uh, you know, I at some point I think I'm, we're supposed to get by the river. And I'll get that on the video, but I just wanted to get the swamp on the video. You know, that's, uh, I tell you, every time I get out, you know, and do a new trail here in Florida, I mean, it's just, it's astounding. The great hiking that we have in Central Florida, you know, it's, uh, and you know, this is a ways from my house, uh, for sure. If I didn't have that Prius Prime, uh, this would be costing me a lot of money and gas for sure to, to strike out to these remote locations. But uh, as it was, you know, I, I came out on the electric charge the whole way. 
Um, so, uh, of course, I, I imagine that battery will be dead by the time I get home. So I will burn maybe a, maybe a quarter of a gallon of gas. <laughs> All right, so let's, um, let's keep on going. But uh, this, this, this is, uh, I just wanted to get the swamp. Like I said, I usually only take video when the trail changes, uh, changes the look and feel. You know, and that was that was the transition. So let's uh, let's just keep on going. So just down from the parking area is another uh, entrance. Uh, so if the parking lot was full, you could just drive down a little further and uh, and come in to the trail that way. I just thought I'd show that on the the video because you know there were four cars there, and I, I bet earlier today is probably even more. So that might be a, an option for you just to drive a little further down uh, service route 39 there and then just come in to the trail through that uh, gate back there. But uh, so anyway, let's, uh, you know, we're just uh, we're just getting started here and uh, you can see it transitioned again. You know, no, so, yeah, there's a there's a palm there, but uh, now we're into like, uh, I don't know what kind of bushes these are. That's, I wish I could. I need to learn more about identifying vegetation and foraging and things like that. But uh, you know, you only have so much time. I'm, I'm just glad to be out hiking. So I've come to a fork in the trail. I took the left hand turn way back when I started, and I don't know. I guess I'll just go to the left here because I'm hoping to get down by the river. Because I said the, I was told you could get a view of the river. Uh, maybe this isn't going anywhere. It looks like there's a fence up here. Let's just keep the video on for just a second. So, so it looks like it's just a. Well, I guess I don't know what they would be. I mean, it's a. It's not even a gate. Why is this trail even here? I I don't. Maybe once upon a time it was a a, a way to get onto the trail. But you can see it's got barbed wire and the gate. Okay, let's just go back the other way. All right. So you can see what it's looking like. It's a little bit of a transition right here. Uh, that's pretty cool, that tree being down. So, all right, let's just keep on going. Well, this is pretty cool. So we've kind of looped around the swamp. And, uh, you know, I bet uh, during the summer this might not be hikeable, you know. Because it's uh, the trail is not that much higher than the swamp, so it's probably going to get wet. And once again, I'm coming to another fork, <laughs> and once again, I'll take the left-hand one and see where it goes. All right. So what it did was it took me to the river. Now look at that! Some dumb idiot left a beer can there. And this per looks pretty recent too. But this nice. Uh, you got a picnic table here, so if you were doing the uh, the river. Uh, you could uh, pull up your kayak or whatever right here and have a picnic on that picnic table and even a fire if you had some firewood along. But uh, quite beautiful. I thought that was an animal <laughs> in the water down there, but it's just a log sticking up. But uh, let's get the river on this side on the video. A uh, lot of foot, tra foot traffic here. Um, so this is a pretty popular spot. Uh, quite beautiful. But I'm going to try this... Uh, this bridge, hope I don't fall through it. It looks like it's in pretty bad shape. And uh, maybe hike along the river for a ways, I guess. I don't know. We'll just see where this goes. Um, so this is turning into an interesting hike. Uh, well, the boards are a little flimsy, but I'm supporting my big fat body, this old fat body. All right, and you can see the trail is narrowing down quite a bit. This might just dead end right up here, like an efficient spot would be my guess, because uh, it doesn't look like this is maintained. Uh, let's see what we got real quick. Uh, yeah, look, look, it's just going to dead end right here. Well, no, it keeps on going. Let's let's keep following. Like I said, I don't know if this is a trail. <laughs> Maybe I'm just going back into the forest or people have blazed away along the side of the river here. But look, you could pull up right here, throw a fishing pole in the water. Uh, it's kind of continuing along if you could call this a trail. Now I do have to worry about spiders because I bet nobody's hiked this today. Okay, let's uh, just keep on going. So how many times have you heard me say 
the hike you get <laughs> is not the hike you expected. So we're coming up on something here. Like I said, I think I'm just off trail at this point, just hiking around in the woods next to the river. Uh, so probably not a maintained area, although I wonder what this wooden pole is. Certainly not a tree stand, not a, I mean a deer stand, I don't think. Uh, but the trail is kind of moving along the river. I did get hit my first cobweb, so like I said, nobody has been this way. Uh, every time I think I'm coming to a dead end, it just keeps on going. So uh, what an interesting hike. This is, uh, this is, this is kind of, kind of, kind of crazy here. You can see, you know, look, look at what you're hiking through. I think it did ends right here. Okay, all right. So yeah, no way to hike through that or go this way. So I wonder why people blazed the trail just to right here and then stopped. You know, I don't know, maybe you're getting some private land or something somewhere up there. I mean, I guess uh, if, you, if you wanted, well, it looks like you could go this way. Let's go a little ways this way, see what we find. And then I'll probably just head on back and uh, finish up the uh, the Oxbow Trail. But, uh, you know, it'd be nice if they would come and cut in this trail, make it into a, you know, real trail. Uh, you know, like I said, I'm more or less just in the woods at this point, of, I believe. So, but it's, uh, it's hikeable. You know, I'm in no hurry to get out of here. Boy, I had to get the cobweb off my phone. <laughs> but look at that. Isn't that interesting looking? Looks like. I don't know what's what's the ones on the ground stalagmites the ones in the in the ceiling or the stalactites is i can't don't remember and you got more over here but that little side trail has come to an end so this will be my your last look at the river boy i tell you doesn't it doesn't that make you want to just jump in although the and they say you know on the signs that i've read that the gators leave you alone you know i, I i'll tell you what i wouldn't want to swim with the gators myself but uh you know, I would rather be in a kayak or something. Uh, but, because uh, I don't trust them. And when you see a 12-foot gator, seems to me you'd be a tasty morsel to that gator. That's that's just my opinion. I, You know, and plus, you know, think think about most people. And, you know, you're just flapping away in the water, you know, and gator come up and pull you down. You know, he could, he could feast off of you for quite some time, you know. That's just my opinion on that. Uh, even though the sign said that gators will leave you alone for the most part. All right, so let's wait till we get past that picnic table and uh, and then we'll get some more on the video. So I thought I'd show you what it's looking like. And believe it or not, I, <laughs> I hit two more cobwebs. How can that be, man? I, I Maybe those people were just parked in the parking lot, uh, parked in the parking lot and didn't hike the trail. I don't know. Uh, strange to me. but uh, So I should have brought the walking stick is what I'm saying. So if you do do this trail, even though it's nice and wide, uh, be sure and bring a walking stick and uh, maybe if I ever come back I'll bring a trash bag and pick up that beer can right there you know god dang it people are so disgusting litter litter everywhere but uh, anyway this is what it's looking like a little, little bit of a transition you know um, I'm not sure how much more video we'll get because uh, it's kind of just looking the same here um, really good on the knees uh, you know it's not a not a horsey trail at all uh, you know the sand is uh, it's it's soft, but uh, it's a it's a nice hike. Uh, look at here, even more trash. Once again, you know, trash, trash. You know, maybe bring a trash bag next time. Although that looks like somebody pooped right there, so wouldn't want to pick that up. There's some more toilet paper. Probably just leave that. <laughs> don't, don't think I'd be picking that up. Now here's another area where for looks like dang on it. Another cobweb, <clears throat> jeez. But here's another, looks like a fire pit with more trash. Uh, but, uh, and of course it looks like we're gonna get another look at the river. Let's take a look. So, oh good, look, another, another picnic table. That's nice. Let's get a look at the river real quick. We'll just walk over here. Boy, that picnic table seen better days, had not it? <laughs> they need to replace that. But yeah, see, this be another good beach to bring your kayak up on or a, uh, a canoe. And just, you know, even though that picnic table's old, you could still uh, you could still use it, I think. I'm not sure I want to sit in the middle of that bench, but uh, probably good enough to have a picnic. But So uh, now I've lost the trail. Oh, there it is. It's going that way. All right, let's keep on going.
Get another clip. Uh, looks like we're just moving right along the swamp. So really, this uh, is kind of a neat uh, trail when you think about it, because you go around a swamp and then hit, hit the river, you know, and both are quite, quite beautiful. All right. All right, I'm going off trail again. This, this is hikeable. Let's just see how far we can get. Boy, back when I used to travel, I would always look for places like this. You know, I just went off trail a ways. You know, catch me if you can, but that would be a, you know, if you're, if you're traveling, like when I would travel from uh, Virginia to um, Michigan or Michigan to Virginia, I was always looking for places where I could just set up a tent and stay for the night, you know? So this would be fantastic. Uh, looks like a, the off trail experience here is over, but look at that spot. That would be a fantastic place to put a tent. And, and who's gonna find you, you know? Uh, cause I came through that to get here, you know, nobody's going to hike over here. Um, you know, and that way you can just sleep in in the morning and pack up and get back on the road, you know, but, uh, maybe, uh, maybe at some point, uh, cause I am going to be traveling camping, um, after I'm done with my divorce, uh, cause I do want to, do want to hit some national forests and, you know, things here in the South, you know, while it's, it's winter time and then, uh. And then someday we'll head back to the Smoky Mountains and that'll be in the summertime. So uh, we'll get that on a couple of videos. So let's just keep on going. So that's it for this hike, because I'm back at the trash can. There's actually a left-hand fork up here as you come out. It probably doesn't go anywhere. But uh, so let's do the mantra. That's it for this trail. Freedom, oh freedom. Good to live in the free state, free Republican state of Florida, where we have no vaccine mandates, no jab requirements, no lockdowns, and we are free to come and go and do as we please and free to work. Peace out. Stay free. So this is that uh, other fork that I was telling you about. Just going to be a little, you know, probably uh, just a dead end or maybe hook back up with the... Uh, the trail, I, I forgot to summarize the trail. It's just a loop around a swamp uh, that takes you by the river. Quite beautiful. Uh, and uh, that's that's all I got to say about the trail. Not, nice, easy hike if you just want to do a quick day hike. Uh, well, look, this is taking you down to the river. Huh, I wasn't expecting that. I'll be daggone. So, yeah, you can kind of see this is going on. Or no, I guess it's just a pond. I don't know. That's why I was saying, you know, I was going, how, how can I be at the river? Well, that's pretty cool, isn't it? Wonder if there's any fish in there. Man. All right, well, let's keep on going. Well, it looks like that rice fork is coming to an end here. Because, uh, well, maybe not. It's uh, definitely off trail, though. <laughs> let's just say, uh, well, it looks, looks like we got a little something to follow here. Uh, that was pretty cool seeing that pond. That's why I thought I it was going to dead end right there at the pond. But you can keep uh, going. I definitely got to keep an eye out for snakes at this point. Well, without hiking pants on, this is uh, this has come to an end. I mean, you could well you can see they have somebody has blazed through here. But uh, oh, here we go. It's kind of moving. I don't know. I'm about ready to turn back. Yeah, I'm turning back. I'm gonna get lost in the woods here. Although you see that broken, it looks like somebody tried to blaze through there. But uh, so that's uh, that's it for this uh, side trail. Peace out. Well, I wasn't done hiking, so I came back to the Johnson Pond, and I uh, I just took a right, and I uh, I don't know where this goes. There's no marks on the trees, no um, you know nothing identifying the trail, so. I'm just assuming that uh, it's just more or less a dirt road because uh, I was trying to hook up with those blue trails that you saw on the sign. So uh, maybe someday we'll come back and make a whole video out of this because uh, it's getting kind of late and I'll probably have to turn around. And But uh, you can see it's not much change in the scenery but from what I've been seeing. I've been on this for about a mile or so and uh, just more or less hiking down a road. Uh, so if you just wanted to get a hike in... That's a little horsey for sure, you know, but not too bad. And, uh, you know, just come into the Johnson Pond and just make a right and you can get on this road. 
you know, if you've already seen the pond like I have, I wasn't interested in seeing the pond. I thought I'd just do something new. So anyway, peace out. Stay free. So came down that. Came down that. Like I said, we'll make a video. But you could, it looks like you could go this direction. But I'm going to go this direction. I just hope I don't get lost back here. <laughs> so, all right, that's it for this video, for sure. That's it in hiking for today. <clears throat> we'll come back and do this sometime. I didn't even know this was here. This is that uh, blue, it did turn into the blue trail eventually because I've seen some marks on the trees. But this would be a really fun day. You know, if you came and just spent the whole day, looks like it's pretty doggone long. And uh, you're just kind of more or less, you know, on a road going through the tree. And like I said, it is horsey, so it's tough hiking. You know, it's real sandy. But uh, anyway, we'll come back someday. I always like to promote my future videos and, uh, and we'll do this all the way, see where it ends up. Uh, I think on one of the trails, you end up at that big bear uh, trailhead. I'm going to try to get there with the car today before it gets dark. Well, we're getting an opening coming up here. Let's just take a look and see what it is, and then I'll turn around. So I was hiking along, and I got to right here. So this is where we are right there. I don't know if you can see this on the video. And uh, I do want to check out this, this camp right here. And then I guess I could have taken this on over and come down this way. Maybe we'll come back and do that someday. And uh, anyway, that's it for today. But this is where I'm going to try to take the car is to this bearhead hammock trailhead and campground just to see what it looks like. All right.